what's going on everyone, Turn up Gary here once again, and well, today I'm going to make my picks for the NFL Wild Card Playoff um, games, that's right, the playoffs are here tomorrow, they start, so I'm going to run down and make these picks, my Kansas City Chiefs have the first run by the that's right, they have the number two seed. Um, but I just thought I would make my picks for the teams in the wild card. So, let me get to the picks. First, let me just say that three out of the four games are all games that the teams played in the regular season. So that's kind of, kind of funny and interesting, I guess. Well, here's the first game. Raiders at the Texans. That's a rematch of the game that was held in Mexico City. Um, of course, the Raiders are without Derek Carr and without um, Matt McLean. I think that's his name. I might be wrong, but well, um, they're without Derek Carr and their other backup quarterbacks. So now they're going to have to deal with their third quarterback which is a rookie of Michigan State. And I really thought that the way that he played in Week 17 against the Broncos, he played terrible. That's why I'm picking Texans. And for the second year in a row, they're, they're hosting a playoff game in Houston. Houston, of course, is home to Super Bowl 51. Um, so, yeah, I just think the Texans are the better, better team. Brock Osweiler will be starting as well. Um, so that's why I'm picking them. Next game, Lions at the Seahawks. Um, you know, the Lions, I, I kind of didn't expect them to make the playoffs after, even though they lost in Week 17 to the Packers. But they were able to make it with the Washington loss. Um, so now they're in there in the number six seed. And they're facing three seed Seattle Seahawks, where a team that is very dangerous in the playoffs and, you know, very scary and stuff. Uh, usually it gets hot in the middle of the season. Or, like, in the second half of the season. And I have Seattle winning. And even, even though I am a Chiefs fan, I also cheer for the Seahawks. They're my favorite team in the NFC. So I'm picking them over Detroit. Next game, the Dolphins versus the Steelers. Um, and let me just say the Lions-Seahawks game was not a rematch from the regular season. Um, the next game, Dolphins-Steelers, that's a rematch game from Week 6. And Miami won that game. Um... But this time it's in Pittsburgh. And Steelers probably could be a team that could that looks like a Super Bowl contender. Um and I personally hate the Steelers. And if the Steelers won, then they would be coming to Kansas City facing the Chiefs. Um but I really don't think Miami won, especially without their starting quarterback, Ryan Tannehill. And their backup, Matt Moore, he's actually not that bad, but I think the Steelers are currently the better team. So I have them winning in the next and final game. The New York Giants at the Green Bay Packers. Also a rematch. Um, and these two teams have met quite a bit in playoff games. I remember back in like 2008, it was one of the coldest NFL games ever. Um, it felt like it was like 20 degrees below zero. I don't know what that cold, but at kickoff it was like 2 degrees below zero. Um, and the Giants won that game. Of course, they took the upset in Super Bowl 42. Anyway, Packers, red hot, winning six in a row, I think, after being four and six this season. 
ten and six in our run of postseason yet again. But I personally think the Giants are the better team. I think they're playing better. Um I just think they're playing better and I think that I honestly would not be surprised if they were in the NFC title game. But I have them winning. So let me know what you guys think. Should be really interesting for the first round of the playoffs. Um, so know what you, you guys think. Um, so thank you much for watching. Like, and subscribe. Um, I'm from Okay, So stay tuned for more videos. And bye.